Welcome to the Pauper Gauntlet. I'm done. I'm gonna play Gruel Kitty in the first round. These rounds are the first two rounds are double elimination. So you have to lose both rounds to get eliminated. And I find an opponent immediately. Playing as Oxosbs. Keeping this. Only the bouncy guys and not uh, the things we want. Uh, Getaxian Probe tells me Delver Fiend. So I'm gonna evolve for a forest. We need more forest than we need mountains. Uh, okay. Ty oh, it's Tireless Tribe combo. That's cool. I never got that to work. Two bouncers and no guys to bounce. I guess I can bounce Rancor the first time. No. I'm gonna have to bounce a land. That sucks. Tireless Tribe. Hitting me for one. Oh, they have great protection from <laughs> uh, bolts. There's the Blastoderm. Wow, this was a clunky hand. But now I need to play Blastoderm first. So he needs to have the cleric guy. Yeah, it's a three card combo that's extremely clunky. He's doing something. Tapping my land, but yeah, go right ahead. I get a firebolt. Do I cast it to get cards out of his hand? Seems pointless. I better go for killing the uh, other guys instead. That enables his combo. He can't fit counterspells in there. Not a counterspell for Blasterderm. And I want my blaster arm. Oh, he's digging so hard for the combo. Digging really hard. Another tribe. And it's try beat down. I can't remember what the deck was called, but I'm gonna tap out here. No! Okay. Then I will have to play Invasive Species. I return a mountain to my hand. <clears throat> I still want to play that blaster arm. I would love to see this idea work. I really never got that to work, but I think my deck was white red trying to reverse the toughness, and now it's gushing too. Uh, about face, you have to have five cards attack and then reverse everything. So I, I should keep red man open. Uh, 
Is there a white card that does the same thing? Yeah, I probably should keep a lightning bolt. And he must have something to protect him against that. Play double rank or attack. And keep red open. Rancor. See if he has any bounce. Rancor. Firebolt one of them finally then. No, 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 no. I'm not sure. Now I have a clock at least. Keep bolt up. Play blaster arm next turn. All he needs is a god willing or something. To protect him. Is he gushing again? Looking for the combo. He did have a lot of card draw for sure. So I think what he's trying to do is discard 5 cards to Tyler's Tribe, make it a 21 1 and make it 1 21 and then reverse its power and toughness. Killing me. And now he actually has 10 cards. And Gush looks pretty good then to get more cards in hand. Will I die to the combo? So this is not in your sideboard plan, Arcadius. You should have thought about this deck. <laughs> no. Electricery seems nice. Pyroblast, of course. Yeah. Seems to be good enablers to stop his combo. Gushing into Pyroblast. Must be horrible. Uh, I think he has... He's trying to calculate if he has what he needs. I can't remember what the white card... Or the other card. I used about face. It's a red card. Inside out. There it is. So I don't bolt it now, because then he can. Doesn't he have to use it first? No, it's until end of turn. That's the way it works. But now it has one toughness. Yeah. Okay, so then he obviously has protection for it. Oh, chance or even. 17. He's 21. This, wa this version of the deck was much better than the one I played. So I tried to bolt it. And it works for him. Pretty awesome. Okay. So we need our electricers and our pilot blasts. So what are we taking out here? 
Let's look at what it typically takes out. Firebolts weren't mighty useful. Just take out one of each, perhaps. Ridgebacks we can do without. And I'm taking out two firebolts. That's my on-the-fly decision. So everybody should include blue, white, tireless tribe in their sideboard class. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, we should be able to deal with this. I'm keeping this. Playing the guild gate, playing Keldon Marauders. Go with Pitskalk. Or even the Kavu. Nice to see the combo work one time, but I'm not gonna let him do that twice. Let's beat down hard! Let's beat down hard and punish him for his sins. Just hitting the tireless tribes with all the removal should reduce his card count. But he, he could get so many cards with Gush. But now Kelda Marauders are beating down. Which is always nice. Oh, this is a nice development. So we do this. Play the Pit Skulk. In case he bounces the Kelda Marauders. Play the Horn Kavu. Return the Kelda Marauders. Doing one damage. That felt good. What turn did he go off? It took a while. Do I need to keep Pyroblast up? For a gush? Maybe I do. He needs to play the tribe first. So we can just go beat down plan here. Wish I had something green to do. Marauders. And then it's lethal next turn. Doing eight and a firebolt. That should work. Gushing. He has eleven cards. Can he get haste somehow? Doubt it. Love the deck. <clears throat> I would admit it that to the Pope Gauntlet instantly. Looks like we got this. Yes. Okay, off to the third game. 
Let's do it. Yeah, looks good to me. It's a bit land heavy. We are... Oh, he, he must mull again horribly. Uh, we are going to get... If I see a tireless tribe, I will bolt it. But now we're getting a forest. And doing the old Kelda Marauders horn kaboo thing again. Young wolf into horn kaboo would have been really nice. Yeah, you better ponder that. And there's the chancery. I go for forest. And Callum Rodas. There you are, young wolf, a bit late. He's looking so hard. Will there be a tribe? And will I bolt it? Yes, I will bolt it. Six cards. The tribe. We already know we're bolting it. And he will, of course, protect it. But it's uh, one less inside out. So he has two. The full five. He has to get through our blocks as well. So this is Keldon Marauders, Young Wolf, Evolving Wilds. For the next turn. Four mana. He's switching the power and toughness. He could give it shadow and draw a card. That's not enough, is it? Oh, he has gush. So this is going to work. I'm going to lose to this. Wow, fantastic. This is actually the kind of loss I love.
in uh, in the proper gauntlet. Losing against something innovative. And it was fast too, wasn't it? Uh, Tyler's tribe. But what does it do against the Shane Edict? I have no idea. But I'm dead. Wow. Okay. All right. Uh, I commended him on his great deck and I will post this magic adding strat. Thank you for watching.